Welcome, I'm your host, Joshua Lowe, and today I'm going to apologize because I didn't do an episode last week, but uh, I'm going to do three, most likely three, and possibly four this week to make up for last week. The first one I'm going to do is today. It's going to be about the North Face Cat's Meow, and it's rated to 20 degrees, comfort rating of 33. Um, it comes in four different sizes. It comes in short, regular, long, and and extra long. Now I have the short version so I'm going to talk mostly about that. The short version can take up to a max height of 5.6. It weighs 2 pounds 8 ounces and it comes with a compression sack and a storage sack. I use this on a number of trips throughout the summer and have let some people borrow this a couple times and the overall response was that it's a very warm sleeping bag for like the summer months or early fall however I took it camping with me this past weekend and overnight the temperatures dropped down to 29 degrees possibly lower than that I guess the AccuWeather real feel was lower than that and I didn't take a tent so I was just on my mat uh, foam the Thermarest uh, Ridge Rest, I believe, is the foam mat that I have. And then I use the Climate Static V2 beneath me. Uh, I had layers on, had a balaclava, several pairs of socks with a thin fleece blanket wrapped around my toes, and I still got cold throughout the night. I ended up uh, waking up around 5.30 and just going over by the fire and or the fire pit and starting a fire. When I went to roll up my bag, it was just covered in frost, which was kind of to be, be expected with the temperatures dropping so low, but overall I was cold, <laughs> and I hate being cold, so the fact that I was so cold when the temperatures dropped into the 20s, uh, I would say comfortably you can use this sleeping bag down to about mid 30s which like I said the EN comfort rating is 33 degrees so if you're using this for winter purposes I would recommend against it um, it's a pretty decent bag for backpacking though in like the fall months well early fall like August September I don't know maybe a couple weeks in October I guess it really depends on where you live but I would not use this for winter camping if that was what you were looking for this bag is not suited for those conditions now as I stated I'm gonna be doing several reviews this week you can look forward to the review that I'm gonna do on a Coleman Silverton bag I believe that one's rated to 25 degrees which was also used this past weekend and I'm going to do a episode where I talk about some of my recent gear pickups and I believe my Cairn box for November comes in this week so I may do an episode on that this week when that comes in. This concludes this episode. Hopefully you tune into the next one.